Okay, what we're going to show you today is how to set up your display and your computer or laptop to allow you to set up a multi-screen display. So if you can move your mouse around your Windows desktop away from any icons and just right click with your mouse and in Vista um, we would now need to select the word personalize. So if you can select that with your left key and then within the next options at the very bottom here you'll see an option called display settings. Again with your left key select display settings. This will launch the display settings box which from in here we can make the adjustments needed to set up a second or third display for your computer. Right, so let's just move this box out the way, the previous screen. And in here you'll see we've got screen one which is your main laptop screen, your main computer monitor screen that you'll use. And you can see on this particular screen the resolution is set at 1440 by 900. Um, on this particular machine we've also got an option for screen two uh, which on a laptop would be your VGA port that is the 15 pin socket on the side or the rear of your laptop and on this particular machine we've also got installed option number three which is a USB to VGA device or alternatively one of our USB to HDMI adapters which you can find on our main store but for today we're just going to show you how to change the settings to number two you can get there by selecting option 2 or by moving the drop down as you can see here so we'll select option 2 but at the moment if you move your mouse over it, you'll see it says not active um, to make that active the easiest way to do that is to select extend the desktop onto this monitor and you'll see that now becomes active once you've done this you will need to find out and set the screen resolution here of the display you are connecting to so if you have a 32 inch TV your screen resolution may be something like 1280 by 768 if you are unsure then of course connect check with your TV user manual and find out what your native resolution is and the same applies of course if you've got a projector or another monitor so once you have that information you need to set that right here if you change the resolution bar and slide it to the right to make that fit as you need. Once that's done select apply and then do you wish to keep these settings select yes and OK and that should now store the resolution and the settings for your second display. To test this um, if you want to launch a program from Internet Explorer in this case we've got BBC iPlayer launched and once you've got this window make it a movable window by minimizing it and what you need to now do is by holding it down with the left mouse key move the bar, move the window should I say, off the screen and you should start to now see that appear on your screen, on your TV. So as we're moving this off one screen it will start to appear on your TV. Once you've done that you can obviously make it fit uh, the screen by adjusting the size or maximizing it to your second display and that's pretty it. That's all you need to know when connecting a second screen to your laptop or your TV. Thank you again for watching and um, this is how you to set up multiple, multiple displays on a Windows Vista machine.